What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Some interesting news today surrounding the Festival of the Lost event starting tomorrow. If you do follow Destiny of the Game on Instagram, you may have noticed an interesting video surrounding the Horror Story Auto Rifle. And of course I'm talking about one of the rewards you can get during this Halloween themed event. So we already knew that in order to get it, you needed to get Fragmented Souls during the Festival of the Lost. Those being obtained via Bounties and Triumphs. What we found out today though was the horror story is going to drop fully masterworked so it's going to be a curated weapon and it's going to drop at 600 power on top of that the perks that it has are rampage and zen moments so you're talking about a really really good auto rifle to use in pve and just to take a look at that i want to compare it to some different weapons that you may have been using throughout year one or so far during forsaken so First off, the origin story. Now, it may have nothing to do with this weapon, but the fact that they both have story, figured that would be a nice way to lead things off. This, oddly enough though, does have Rampage as well. So, that makes me think that the horror story is gonna occupy a similar niche in terms of rounds per minute and magazine. This, of course, being in that 450 rounds per minute archetype. So, if you use this, you may have used this a lot during year one, the horror story could be in the same category. Let's take a look at another year one weapon though. That is the Braytech Winter Wolf. So when you got this weapon, you may have been using this quite extensively because it's in that same 450 rounds per minute, but it also had high impact reserves. So you're talking about a weapon that could do some serious damage in PVE. Couple that with the fact that it has really good range when compared to the origin story. And you're talking about a weapon that could be effective in medium contact but also at longer range distances as well so this is a weapon that i use quite a bit once i got it during warmind uh, last but not least the tiger spite so this is a weapon that you may have seen me using quite a bit during live streams and during videos in general because it is a really good weapon to use in pve just like the first two it occupies at 450 rounds per minute and although it does have a slightly less magazine because this is a year two weapon, you have the ability to get random rolls. So, for instance, mine has kill clip and high impact reserves. But I could also, if I wanted to increase the magazine, I could change it up and go with either a mod to do that. Or if you have a different roll, you can also bump up the magazine that way. So, I'm excited for the horror story because if it does occupy that similar niche in terms of the rounds per minute, the perks for it are amazing. The fact that it comes fully masterworked is really, really good. It's hard to find those curated roles, so the fact that there's a quest related to doing that I think is intriguing. And last but not least, the fact that it drops at 600 power is incentive enough for most people to go for the grind to get it because that is going to result in a pretty significant boost for your overall light level. So let me know if you're as excited as I am when it comes to the horror story. Also, let me know too if there's interest in doing a live stream to help people get that weapon. I know we don't know exactly what it entails, but we'll find out more tomorrow. If there is interest, we could look into doing that sometime this week or during the event to help people get that. So let me know in the comments if you're interested in that. Most importantly though, have fun during the Festival of the Lost, and we'll catch up soon.